moment for trimming in. So today we are going to have one of my uh, occasional sit-ins where we're just gonna be talking and you guys are getting to know more about me. So today I have a surprise. I have um, someone that is very dear to me and someone that I really, really appreciate, uh, especially during the lockdown, someone has just been there for me and without wasting much of my time, let me introduce to you my close friend, Ms. Valeria Abdel. <laughs>
child. Like you were so happy coming from that. So happy. And then we, we went to sleep. And the following day was the lockdown. First day of lockdown. First day of lockdown, and everything was pretty much closed. We were just at home. And we were staying. So at this B and B, we were staying the the three of us, no, the four of us. Oh, with that guy. We were, we were four. That guy was cool, by the way. Yeah, but I never used to talk to him that much. I forgot. He didn't talk to anyone. Warren. His name is Warren. Oh yeah, Warren. So it was Warren, V, Tams, and me. In this nice. By the way, you should say that our house was actually very nice. Yeah, yeah. We were. I think we were actually very lucky because I know people who stayed in, in like a flat with four walls and that was it. Oh. And we had a house. We had a balcony. We had a pool. We had a we backyard. Were, we had a backyard. It was such a nice house. It was a really nice house. It was the best. And then we moved. So the following day, and so at this B and B, this guy was so amazing because they used to give us breakfast. Yeah. So we all went to this like there was this breakfast nook where you just get there and then you serve yourself cereal and yeah. coffee. Oh. And we were just all there oh. and then we started That's talking. Awesome. We just started talking. That's when we actually started talking. Yeah, I remember I was the last one to wake up type of thing. Yeah. And yeah. then I remember I just woke up and I was like, you know, people chilling, talking. Yeah. And then I got I sat there with my breakfast, whatever. And I was just listening. And then we started we started talking then. Like we kind of clicked. Yeah, we did. There was a, some moment in the conversation where I was like, "Okay, <laughs> I see you, girl. Like, I see you." <laughs> oh, yeah, it was we, nice. It was really nice. It was very nice. What were nice. we talking about, though? Oh, so many things. I don't want to say. Warren that. was talking about. We spoke about movies, wars. We talked about everything. Talking about something. Sam. Is it not Sam? Then that happened. Yeah. So from then onwards, we just clicked. Yeah. Not really. Like I feel like the first month we didn't really talk much. We, yeah. Everyone, I feel like the first month everyone was just kind of no, like in their room, room and just like hi, 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 hi. It wasn't a lot, remember? And well, then I was watching a lot of movies. I remember. I would, I would just wake up, take a shower, just go and chill in the lounge. Uh, oh, and then I was still so hyped up about my YouTube video. I think if you followed me the first, oh the first days, the big, the first days of lockdown, I was shooting videos. She so was. we were sharing a kitchen, and every time they wanted to come in, <laughs> I would be there, just you know, talking with my cameras, with your cameras. There was a time I wanted to, I always tell her that like, there was a time I wanted to make food. I wanted to cook, you know. Mm-hmm. So I walk in there and I'm like, you know, I'm about to cook. And there's this girl, she's there with camera, like, there was no light, but she's just there, like, taking a video of food. It's like prepared, and she's like, hi guys, welcome to the <laughs> Okay, time. 
and husband. A wife. <laughs> you see how tan is dressed. That's how. Like I was like, okay, it doesn't look at me. <laughs> but I was like, okay, it's this lady. I can't talk to her. Like you know those people you can't really talk to like about anything. You can't bring certain things up. Yeah. And I don't like that. So I like people who. Up. I like people who can even if it's un, like uncomfortable for them, they can just brush it off. Be like, oh, okay, like you know, yeah. just that skill. So I thought with you, I wouldn't be able to like just talk. I'd have to be like, oh, how's the cooking going? <laughs> so, <laughs> how's the cooking? <laughs> That's what I thought, honestly. Well, how's uh, the Bible going? So, how's the Bible study? So you wanna pray with me? So I think that was my first. Uh, it's just, like my, right now, it's been almost a year, so my my memory is destroyed. <laughs> but right now, I think like yeah. And then after you got to know me. Oh, how do, how, what was the expression? You thought I was too so snug and not no. accommodated. You could tell me anything. There was a time we, we, we started talking about how we were in school, how we were like back in the day, and I told you some of my stories, and I was like, okay, this girl, what some of those stories were really stupid. And I thought, okay, this girl's not gonna talk to me anymore. And then she starts telling me things. Okay, yeah. cut this foot. <laughs> I'm not cutting it. No, but honestly, there was a time I was like, okay, so I like that. that. Much like, yeah, I felt like okay, I can tell this chick. Can open up. Yeah, I can open up. It was very nice. Yeah, and always think that you know when you have something in common. Yeah, you clean. Because sometimes you just feel like okay, I'm gonna tell this girl everything, and she's just gonna judge me. I wouldn't tell you if I really, really, really felt that, but yeah, I felt like well, I guess I'm already getting closer. And, Chilly and I mean when you when you were t- t- okay four of you in the house <laughs> what else can you be with <laughs> and you're literally locked you can't you go make friends you can't go out you're not meeting people so you know we slowly but surely but this is what I actually thought I thought after lockdown when they opened up things we're not gonna be talking yeah oh you told me that before yeah like I just felt like. I thought that it was just going to end there, you know. Mm-hmm. Then we started talking about things. We started talking about how, uh, yeah, exactly. So here's the thing: we got locked down, no jobs, and just, just, just being locked down. So you need to, you get into the survival mode where you feel like I need to do something. Yeah. I need to. Okay. Mm-hmm. By the way, we bo- we both did have partners, but then it's not always enough, and it's not always a good business. No, but I think what you're talking about is we had to think how we're gonna make it. Like, what we're gonna yeah, eat, what we're gonna eat, eat. Uh, how so, we're gonna make money in this gonna, lockdown. And we're both foreigners. Like, we're both foreigners in this country, and you yeah, know, South Africa has no job, so we were like, what are we gonna what do? What are we gonna do? Like, <laughs> what are we gonna do? Mm. And then we had ideas. Um, I remember, so like the beginning of lockdown, I started doing, I started selling uh, PPEs, yeah, masks, gloves, and it was like, yo, and Bo was just asking me, what are you up to? <laughs> um, selling masks, do you want some? Yeah, yeah <laughs> and I So that was like the first thing I did was to just be selling PPEs, and then the second thing was I met a friend uh, from from long back, um, and we, we we actually clicked. So I asked him. He has been here for a long time. So I asked him, "What are you What are you up to?" So he said, "You know what? Let me come and pick you up and show you what goes on." And then he took me. He, he took me to this. We took me to Joburg, yeah. Yeah, not Joburg, but then he took. It wasn't Joburg. He took me to this place, like somewhere for somewhere in Kempton Park. And then there was a wow. warehouse that was stocked up with um with sanitizers. Oh, I remember sanitizers. Oh, yes. that's how it started. That's how it started. I just can't yes. that's how, that's how I remember how those bottles, the blue sanitizer. The blue, yeah, yes, yes, that's how it started. And then and, he, and then he wow. told me that you know what, you can actually buy because they were selling it at at wholesale price. So you could actually buy it at wholesale, then package it. Yeah. Into whether yeah, whatever, whatever you want. Yes, to. and then sell it like that. So I came back, I was so mind blown, I was like, and the capital, you were that excited. Was, yeah, and the capital that was needed was like 3k, I think. 
Just you have three K. You need a three K. It's coming back for me. Oh my god. You. <laughs> I remember. Just three K. Mm. And then I came back. I was like, V. I have a business idea. Okay. Before I start talking about this, let me just say one thing. This lady right here, she is one person. If even if I tell her the craziest thing, like V, I wanna sell papers, or I wanna sell roaches. Roaches. She, she was gonna be like. Let's okay. get it. <laughs> she was like, when I was starting, then, that's actually that's mm. one thing I love about you. Like, yeah, like yeah, there's nothing, about you as well. there's nothing that you can't, that you feel like we can't do. Yeah, you know, we can do anything. Like, literally, <laughs> like she'll be like, and then, okay, so, so you always have ideas. <laughs> you all like you like a generator of ideas, and I'm always like, okay, okay, let's do this. <laughs> Okay, t- what what I love this. Uh, it was so amazing. And then I came with my idea, and then you're just like, yeah, let's do it. So what do we have to do? And I came with bottles. You had a small bottle yeah. and like two big bottles. Two big I bottles. Still remember. Are you still and this it smells good. It was one of those that you need sanitizer to smell good. Yeah. So I was like, it's really good. It's so nice. So I was I was literally up for it. You were. Uh, and then, cause she in the B and B, she stayed in the the nicest. That ha- that was so big. And it was it had like an end suit. It was really nice. Yeah, yeah, and it had that big table. The big table. So we turned her room into our office and started yeah. our new company, guys. If you have not seen this, two. What's the name? What's the name? Two one two. two. <laughs> Clearly. Welcome to Clearly. <laughs>